Today's topic is about the media's role on what to report and what not to report. When I was in Indranagar some years back, maybe 20 years back, when there was a plane crash, as it took off, it just boom and fell down, and so many dead bodies. And the TV was showing the photographs of the bodies lying. The huge hue and cry because this is not a in standard international standard to show the dead bodies. From then onwards, the media has become more disciplined what to show, what not to show. Like that, if the media has to be trained what to report, what not to report. Like the criminals, they are not supposed to show their faces. The today's topic is because of the continuous. or last one year of attack on the on the girls by the lovers and then getting killing them and cutting them into pieces this has been reported in a massive big scale yes one step leads to 10000 please try to understand So one step or love leads to ten thousand or love and happiness. But once you report one bad thing, you see the one bad thing what happened in Delhi or something, and it is continuously happening non-stop in the media is reporting. Media should stop reporting this one. The police should immediately involve the political mainstream should involve. Tell the media this is not a thing to be reported in a mass scale, but. immediately the culprit should be caught and procedures of getting the psychologist the people involved just a simple example in in the japanese youngsters especially the teenage boys have all the big big motorbikes and most of the they import bullet from india also bullet motorbikes from india they go in a gang of 50 100 with the chains and all the things and I have seen when I was walking, Japanese boys jumping the wall and running. They're so scared. And then I see the police van going behind. Hmm. They won't say anything. They just go behind these boys when the gang is moving. And next day you can see almost all the boys if they are studying in the school or college. The college authorities get the child's number, and the college authorities will call the boy and. Ask him to slowly withdraw. They'll ask him why you joined a the gang. Then, if the the gang leaders are um, working in a company, then the re- police will report to the company. Company will call the boy slowly, slowly, slowly. They without anybody knowing, without police beating them up, drag, dragging them, arresting them, nothing. They just work beautifully with the with the system where the children are involved, and slowly the gang is broken. Yes, like that, we should. Get the people. He and his friends. A lot of this violence is because the censorship said mouth to mouth kissing, direct sexual intercourse should not be shown. Direct nakedness should not be shown. Very beautiful. But then they should also make sure violence cannot be shown at all. What is this violence? Carrying knives and guns and shooting and killing, and uh, they are making money out of that. No, no, no! Stop it! That has to be totally banned. It should be banned. Otherwise, a revolution should happen to ban it, because children are suffering. We have broken this family, the joint family, and the family tree. The whom do the children go to ask? They are looking for love, and the first person who just smiles and gives them love, they just openly believe them and go. I had a nikocha. Niko, niko means cat. Nikocha means kitten. in japanese language so we named it because the school was uh, trying to l- learn little japanese culture just to teach the poorest of the poor children that even after japan was bombed and they became a nobody they worked 7 days and they climbed up the ladder we are still in the poverty without we getting bombed so this nikocha and this small um, kitten was playing with everybody and we have a you know um, we have another one doggy Also, and he was a little naughty one. So whenever he goes to attack, I said, "No, no, no." So this our doggy uh, and this uh, Nikocha, they both will be playing. It's a small baby. I was sleeping. 
early morning i heard my children go screaming guruji guruji i had a heart many of my children scream i just sure i know something happened i got up from bed i started running at the back said back said in indranagar there was no compound wall in the beginning days street dogs they entered the back said they were always coming by back said this small kitten she doesn't know she went to play with them thinking that my inu dog doggy which is our pet dog she was playing she thought the other doggies are also the same she went to play and my children saw the street dog middle caught hold of her shook when i ran and saw the my cat the my kitten in the mouth of the dog and he shaking it i ran i said we're going to tear the dog into pieces he left the kitten down we took it uh, by then it is no more the whole school cried and we gave big burial and all what i'm telling is kitten and our girls we broke the family of my girls of my of my people the joint family and the family tree so whom do you think they they know they only one father and one mother not in the joint family where they have 800 to 1000 people they have not been even brought to that stage so when they go to the street they say another one more person they are like many men they want to see many uncles they become friendly that friendship has been uh, just misused please do not report that the children have been killed and cut into pieces stop it for god's sake stop it this is not the india we are looking this is not the country we are looking that this kind of reporting is only repeated reporting repeated is becoming more almost every month some reporting coming from the media as if they have the you know, what call uh, they are have the uh, publicity going very fast for so more people are watching for that for that the trp rating for that for the trp rating are you trying to just push the country getting more children killed how do we stop it let us carpet bomb the length and breadth of the country with teams to find out how we can get the family the joint family in the family tree connected with that we can wipe out poverty we don't need electricity people go and do, uh, collect solar lights we don't need water water is not a problem because every family will make sure that they will collect the uh, rain water water will not be a problem every family know that sanskrit culture has been maintained beautifully every child will find as much love as possible because in the family in the joint family that's only love the children do not have to go outside to find another love excess of love is there when they they don't find varieties of uncles and aunties and brothers and sisters and cousin brothers cousin sisters there is a psychological disease and psychologists and the pharmaceutical companies are making money we should stop that it's almost like a bar the pharmaceutical companies medicine is like a bar it's a the drug it's like gencha opium we should stop it my request that a revolutionary tactic should be formed to stop this in in, in every part of the india every part of the world and the media should be very much mature please don't report we don't want to see it's too painful it's too painful stop it especially boys look at your look at your girls as if it is goddess don't look at them as a sex object you must understand because the society has been degenerated they are remote controlling you you must under you are not human being because somebody else is remote control look at them as human as goddess as a sister as a mother and you can find only beauty